The paintings are kind of created in a sense to, to do what I want them to do. You know, I want you to kind of look through, through these holes to see what's behind them. And I want you to kind of have a sense of uh, you know, what that might be like. You're bringing your own ideas to it and your own memories as well when you're looking at the paintings, hopefully. The first time I went to the desert, I went to do a, a, a kind of a tiny residency in Alice Springs and, and uh, I went to um, Serpentine Gorge. At that time I wasn't that prepared, I went, I had like, you know, my jandals on, uh, flip flops and, uh, you know, and I, and I went swimming through this gorge which was freezing and also it was really, really tight. So you're swimming but it's maybe six or seven feet across, in a sense. That's kind of the feeling I want to evoke a little bit, just going through. Mm. Obviously the negative space, that the large white negative spaces are very important in your works. They, they pop up in, in almost every one. Yeah, I guess in these ones I'm kind of compressing that space a little bit to bring it into the centre. That's something I really haven't done before so much. Uh, and I've been creating these uh, bands of light that come across the pictures. I, you know, that's another thing that I've done a little bit of, but in these paintings that's become a more important feature. Is it a challenge to achieve that movement in the water? Did you find that when you first started doing that, that was a difficult thing to do? I absolutely think it is a difficult thing to do, but at the same time it's a really rewarding thing to do. Something about painting the sea is just, just uh, sort of beautiful and scary at the same time. You're searching for a landscape that, that has drama? Yeah, a landscape that has that sense of danger about it and that you have that kind of feeling with it. And it's, I mean, that's kind of, I guess it sounds a bit ridiculous to say that, but that's what I'm trying to achieve. Whether you can achieve it or not, I don't know. But that's what I'm trying to do. You know, so ideas about a very active, very dangerous uh, world that we live in and trying to make you see that you're just a tiny part of it, you're not kind of in control.